We have here a female brand banded bamboo shark. Now this female has been laying eggs for the past month or two because it is their egg laying season and the eggs so far appear to be infertile and so that means that the timing is right to put this frozen semen in. The uh, frozen semen sample that we've used today, um, we have thawed a sample out and examined it under the microscope. It seems to be viable. There's, there's still fairly good numbers of, of, of sperm there and they're also quite motile. There's a high motility. So the sample's about as good as we're going to get um, and so that's why we're reasonably confident that it will work. Two egg cases there that John's pointing out to, uh, one on either side. They have two sides of the uterus and so she's got an egg case on um, both sides of the uterus. We would be disappointed if we didn't see these egg cases uh, and in fact we wouldn't be doing the insemination uh, if the egg cases weren't there. So John's now um, thawed out the semen and uh, we're, we're getting it ready uh, in a syringe and catheter to do the actual artificial insemination. We know there's eggs there in, the, uh, in a reproductive tract and so now's a good time to, uh, to put the frozen semen in. So you put the catheter up, you can see we're going a long way because we've got to get up where the uh, eggs are um, so that uh, we can, we can fertilise them. Putting the, putting the uh, semen in and then flushing it through so that she gets the full dose. So we'll, we'll now transport her back to her original tank because that's where she's got to wake up in. And that's the procedure done. The whole um, transporting of semen is still in a development stage. Uh, the advantage of freezing semen is, is the longevity of the, the storage. And so you can then store samples for, for decades. Uh, and it also acts as uh, the transfer, the ability to transfer semen around the world so that you don't get inbreeding. Uh, it increases the, uh, it, it's, it's gene banking where you're, you're preserving our species for the future.